67 Fire UTGO Bond Financing. And tonight's presentation is brought to us by our finance director, Mr. David Goldman. Mr. Goldman? All right, thank you, Mayor. Um, Council, uh, David Goldman, finance director. Um, this item is for the um, bond ordinance for the fire station and the uh, Quint ladder truck that was approved as part of the um, of the excess bond levy that the voters voted on um, a few months ago. Let's go to the next slide here. So the purpose of this ordinance is to um, authorize the designated representative who in the ordinance, it's the city administrator along with the finance director um, to work with the city's bond council and financial advisor who are both here to answer your questions, um, but to um, work with them to conduct the sale of the voter approved bonds within the parameters set in the ordinance. A little background, um, as you'll recall on July 12th last year, the um, city of Oak Harbor City Council submitted an excess levy fire bond ballot proposition to the voters for fire response time improvements, specifically for a new a new fire station in the uh, west side of town, southwest side of town, and a Quint ladder truck. That was approved overwhelmingly by the voters by a vote of over 60%, um, about 62 um, point something, 0.4, point 0.6% in the uh, November election. So following the will of the voters, the next step in the process is to authorize a designated representative to go ahead and work with the uh, City's Bond Council and Financial Advisor to conduct the sale of bonds with the most advantageous terms within the parameters of the ordinance. Um, notably, the aggregate principal amount will not exceed the $9.2 million that the voters designated. Um, also, the interest rate um, not, is not to exceed 5.5%. And also, the final maturity will not exceed the 20, uh, 21 years after issue, which was also in, the, um, in that ballot title. So moving forward, I have a motion on the screen, which I'm not going to attempt to read, but it's basically the exact title of the ordinance that's in your backup. So um, with that, um, myself and our bond council and our financial advisor are available to um, answer any questions you may have on this item. Thank you, Mr. Goldman. Uh, before we turn to council, I'd like to verify with the city clerk that we've gotten no input from our public or questions or anything that's correct mayor we received no input from the public okay then we'll bring it back to council and uh um, i know that you've gotten some information on this previously and maybe you're just ready to do a motion who knows uh mayor pro tim heisen uh, first, I want to say again how pleased I am that the voters passed this this bond. I think that you know there was a little bit of apprehension on the city's part that everybody was kind of suffering from tax fatigue or inflation fatigue, all of the above. But you know we also understand the importance of providing public safety services and you know our aging facilities and our expanding population. And I think that. You know, just like the transportation benefit district, this is um, this was this was kind of a you know a message that when we are clear and upfront about our intentions with you know funding and exactly what we need to use uh, certain funding streams for, then you know the voters respond positively and say, okay, we understand the need and we're willing to to pitch in to make this happen. So I'm just every time I see that 62 point whatever percent, I'm just delighted so thank you very much to the citizens of oak harbor uh, we will not let you down this is going to make um, a big difference in terms of public safety and with that i move to approve the recommended action as presented second so we have a motion and a second uh, well said uh, mayor pro tem nice job uh, i totally agree and and uh, feel blessed we have a motion and a second to uh, approve the recommended action just as it is presented in front of you and in your packet. Any questions or, okay, seeing none, all in favor signify by raising your right hand. Okay, that looks like it passes unanimously, none opposed. Thank you again, uh, uh, council, voters and, and staff, all of you, thank you.